This C++ code compares two approaches for summing elements in an array and highlights how removing branching can significantly improve performance. The function test branching creates an array of 100,000 integers filled with random zeros and ones. It then computes the sum of all elements equal to one using two different strategies, one with a branch and one without. In the first loop, the code uses a traditional if statement to check whether each element equals one. If the condition is true, it adds the element to sum. In the second loop, the code takes a branchless approach by computing data i times equal to data at i equal to 1. Here, data at i equal to 1 evaluates to either 1 or 0, so the multiplication automatically filters out elements that aren't equal to 1 uh, without requiring a conditional branch. And when we run this, we can see that at least on my system, the branchless version is about twice as fast as the branching version. Uh, this difference comes from how modern CPUs handle branching. In the first loop, the if statement creates a branch in the control flow, and when the pattern of zeros and ones is unpredictable, the CPU branch predictor can mispredict. Each misprediction flushes the pipeline and causes a performance penalty. In contrast, the branchless version avoids this problem entirely by using arithmetic to achieve the same effect. With no conditional jumps, the CPU can process instructions more efficiently and fully leverage instruction pipelining and vectorization. This example illustrates how avoiding branches in performance critical loops can dramatically improve speed, especially when working with unpredictable data patterns.